Well, they haven't quite gotten to the school uniform issue right now, but it should be coming up momentarily. The district did a survey last month, and they surveyed teachers, parents, as well as students at various open house events. And it is the results of that survey that the school board is going to take into consideration. We asked these Citrus Grove Elementary School parents in Volusia County, are they for school uniforms, against them, and why? I would like them. I think it would be good for the kids to all be dressed in the same thing, and there's no worries about shoulder lengths, the lengths of their shorts. Against them. Why is that? Um, I feel it's too restricting for kids this age. Uh, high school level, I understand, because more of them are trying to get away with more stuff. But as far as elementary, I feel they should be able to wear anything as long as it's appropriate. The Volusia County School District surveyed teachers, parents, and students. Out of more than 21,000 respondents, 49% are in favor of school uniforms, 47 are not, and about 4% have no opinion. Those who don't like uniforms say there's no personal choice. The district already has a dress code, and there's cost. Overwhelmingly, as you would expect, students were not in favor of a uniform, but our teachers and our parents are. The Volusia County School Board is being presented with the findings. They can choose to go forward with school uniforms or not. This would not be implemented this school year. It would be for the 16-17 school year. If they decide to move forward with it, we will need to develop that policy over the next couple of months and then bring it back to the school board for two public hearings. So the final public hearing we think would be around February. And at both of those meetings, public will have an opportunity to provide input. And again, that survey is just part of the whole picture that they're going to look at as it relates to school uniforms. We'll let you know what they decide. They still haven't gotten to that issue just yet. As far as public comment, that's going to be taken up at 6 o'clock. I'm Gail Pascal Brown, live here in Volusia County for West 2 News.